Now, your weather forecast with meteorologist Jasmine Lomax. Welcome back. Well, it was another warm day outside, and it's felt a little bit warmer than what the temperatures are saying. But as you see outside, nice and lots of sunshine in the picture. We're currently sitting at 91, but it feels like 94. Winds out of the east southeast at around 10 miles per hour. Now, across the rest of the southern portion of the state, heat indices in the 90s all around. 95 in New Orleans, 94 in Bell Chase. Homa at 96, so it is very warm. According to those feel like temperatures, now our dew points are in the 60s in most areas, some areas like New Orleans in the 70s. This is relatively low because once we do reach the 70s, it starts to feel a little bit more muggy outside. And we're enjoying some relatively nice weather, especially for June. Now, tomorrow, our dew points will stay low as well. Now, uh, there are a few showers moving in and out of the picture on the satellite and radar, but the good news is it's not a washout. These are very isolated, and we're going to stay mostly dry throughout the evening. So this is what we're looking at. Light winds around 11 p.m., 76, and we continue to cool down into the 60s. Then starting off the day nice and warm, and we stay dry overnight. Plenty of sunshine in the picture tomorrow as our temperatures rise into the 90s. So again, lots of sunshine as we start the day. Around 1 p.m., we're at 90. Then at 3 p.m., we're at 92. That's going to be the high for the day. Then we begin to cool back down into the 80s, then the 70s, and again, possibly the 60s. Now, tomorrow, our UV index is going to be at 11. That's that extreme range. So make sure that you grab the hat and sunglasses as well as the sunscreen. Now, find shade if you're outside during the middle of the day and make sure to limit your time outside. Now, just take a look at the future cast. Again, we are going to be mostly dry overnight and tomorrow, but a few showers moving into the picture by about 8.30 here in the capital city. We are nice and dry. We stay that way overnight and on Monday, mostly dry outside. Same thing on Tuesday and even on Wednesday. So overall, we're looking at a very nice and dry pattern ahead and actually a little bit unseasonable. So notice, rain chances at zero throughout the work week. Then on Saturday, a slight chance for an isolated shower. Same thing on Sunday, a few showers are possible. We're also very quiet in the tropics right now, so overall this forecast has been a nice and very mild. So again, tonight we're dropping to about 68, clear overnight, quiet, cool, light winds, and overall uh, it's going to feel great with those lower dew points. Then tomorrow, not too muggy outside. We're at 92 with plenty of sunshine throughout the picture, and again, light winds. And just remember that we've partnered with iHeartRadio Baton Rouge to give you your weather on the go, and this is what we're looking at over the next few days. Lots of sunshine in the picture as well as dry days. We're really not expecting much precipitation, if any, over the next week. We could see a few isolated showers over the weekend, but we're not expecting washouts. So overall, nice and quiet. 92 through Wednesday. Our low temperatures will be near average as well in the upper 60s and lower 70s. Then we start to see uh, our shower chances raise as we head into the weekend. But overall, the first day of summer looks to be a great one. 92, lots of sunshine in the picture. Then Father's Day, 90 outside, so slightly cooler. And our precipitation chances do begin to go up a little bit. But if you do have any outdoor plans right now, it looks like you are good to go. We're just expecting a few scattered showers. And just remember to check your blood pressure.